Diesel engines are widely used in vehicles where power is more important than speed. Then how does a diesel engine work? Is it the same as the gasoline engine? Why the diesel engine has a large torque? We will study it. The diesel engine and gasoline engine have the same basic principles. That is internal combustion. This internal combustion produces energy in form of an explosion. The explosion has energy to expand a space. If we put the combustion in a closed cylinder, the piston will be pushed. Then below the piston, there is the crank mechanism. As you can see, the crank mechanism converts the vertical motion of the piston into rotational motion. So what makes combustion appear in closed cylinders? Here the difference between the diesel engine and the gasoline engine. In gasoline engine, we need fuel, oxygen, and fire spark. The carburetor will mix fuel and air. Then put it into the cylinder. When the spark plug is on, combustion occurs. How about a diesel engine? The diesel engine only needs air and diesel fuel without a fire spark. The reason, diesel fuel will automatically burn when it is at 210 degrees Celsius. This happens because the air temperature in the cylinder will be increased to 500 degrees Celsius. This exceeds the flash point of diesel fuel, so the fuel will burn immediately without triggering. For detail, see the following animation. Diesel engine has four steps just like gasoline engine, it is intake stroke, compression stroke, combustion stroke, and exhaust stroke. Intake stroke. This step serves to enter air into the cylinder. When the piston moves downward, the cylinder volume is expand and the intake valve opens. This cylinder expansion will suck air from the intake manifold. The second is the compression stroke. In this step, the air temperature is increased. To raise the air temperature, we only need to increase the pressure. Because the air temperature is directly proportional to its pressure. To increase the pressure, the piston moves upward. So that the cylinder volume decreases, and both valves are closed. This forces air into a narrow space, so that the pressure and temperature rise. The third is the combustion stroke. At this stage, diesel fuel is injected into the combustion chamber. As explained earlier, the fuel burns immediately because the air temperature exceeds the fuel flash point. It result combustion in form of expansion force that pushes the piston down. Lastly is the exhaust stroke. After combustion, the piston immediately moves back upward. At this time the exhaust valve is open. So that the movement of the piston pushes the residual gases into the exhaust manifold. After reach the exhaust step, the engine has finished in a cycle, after that, piston move down to do intake stroke and the cycle repeat again. Above the cylinder, there is a valve mechanism. This mechanism has a function to regulate intake and exhaust valve opening based on the crank rotation. So the faster the engine RPM, the faster valve open. It make the valve opening always accurate. That's the explanation of the four-stroke diesel engine. Subscribe and hope it is useful.